All right, guys. What's up now? Bailey Inspector, go ahead with questions whenever you're ready. Hey, Bailey. Um, just what are your overall thoughts and takeaways from tonight's game? Uh, hats off to Georgia. Great team. Uh, they had a great performance, great plan. And then uh, proud of proud of our team. Um, felt like felt like crap on both sides of the ball, all three phases in special team, defense, and offense. And uh, we'll learn from this. There's a lot of good good and bad things that we'll take from this. Blessed to have this opportunity and moment uh, right out the gate. It's a it's a great opportunity to come out and have a team uh, to play Georgia. Um, and the stage that was set tonight. Um, we'll make we'll make we'll make strides from this, and we'll learn from this and continue to grow. You guys held Georgia without an offensive touchdown. Um, is that something that you guys can take away as a bright spot from tonight and kind of build off of that defensively moving forward? Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we'll, we'll watch the tape tonight. We'll correct our mistakes and see what we can do better. And there's always things that we can improve on. Um, I'm just proud of the way D-line played, DBs played. Um, just thankful we got for to have the guys behind me um, to go out there and do their job and trust those guys. What was the message, if you can share a little bit, just from what Coach Schwinney told you guys in the locker room after the game? Uh, just proud of us. Um, so we gave tremendous effort. Um, it's not the at the end of the game. Um, we never want that to happen, happen obviously, but. Just continue to improve, trust each other, trust that we're going to get better from this. Um, come back next week with a game one mentality um, that next week's a, a game of a, like a game, a season of its own. And um, just prepare all we can, um, learn from this and move on to next week. We're just, he said, he said, we'll continue to grow from this. Um, was proud of the way we, we had the effort that we had, the intensity, the focus, the leadership. Um, it's all good, but didn't come out on top. You had one of the bigger plays defensively with the interception. Take us through that play and just overall, how do you feel about your performance individually tonight? Uh, say, the, say the first part of the question again. I was just asking if you could, yeah, yeah, just your interception, if you could take us through your, through that play for you. Uh, just read it, drop back in my, my drop was reading quarterback's eyes and, and play and Thankful for the, I mean, was excited, very excited. Um, it was a great opportunity, just blessed that it happened and continue to, I guess, continue to um, get better when, I guess, uh, capitalize on those things when they come. And then the, what was the second question? Sorry. Just kind of overall your thoughts on your own individual performance and how uh, you felt, felt about it. It was great. Um, I mean, there's things that I can get better at for sure. Um, there's plays that I I wish I was there at the end of the game. Um, have to get a stop, have to make another play, and then it converted the first down. Um, there's always things that I can get better on for sure. Um, can, we'll watch the tape. Coach V will grade it, and I'll come back, go in tomorrow, and see what I can do, um, see how I can get better for South Carolina State. And just continue to improve, uh, lead, and get the guys around me to understand what they're doing. Like I said, it's a huge stage. Um, for our, for our defensive line and everybody just come out there and get that experience and to feel what it's like. I mean, the atmosphere was great. And to have that experience just with a full stadium, um, great opportunity. And like I said, we're just thankful. And we'll continue to get better. Coach Venables mentioned that he hated that Tyler couldn't play, but he was proud of some of the other defensive linemen who stepped up. What, what did you think of the way the defensive line played? And just also, how, I'm sure you felt, felt, felt for Tyler, too, that he couldn't make couldn't play tonight. Yeah, I mean, you never want that to happen to anybody. Tyler did everything in his power uh, to try to be out there with us. And uh, chips didn't fall his way. But, um, I mean, the D-line played great. Um, did everything they could. They handled, handled adversity well. They came out. Did Rook, um, Trey. They did all they could. Man, they fought. Proud of those guys. Proud of Brian. Proud of the DNs and just handling the things that we had to do to get done. Um, Thought they played great. Looking forward to for how they continue to get better and, and the depth that we'll get throughout the year. Any other questions for Palin?
All right. Thank you all very much. Thanks, Balin. Appreciate it, man. Thank you.